Hello everybody, I'm Asad Zaman Biswas. Today I came to discuss a few more things about JavaScript. Today I like to discuss about Evolve method. Evolve, Evolve method. So I will explain it with example. Basically, what is Evolve method? Evolve method is used to execute its uh, argument or evaluate its argument you can say what does it mean uh, let us see it with an example i think in that case we will uh, get the point what is the meaning of it evaluates or executes its argument so we will learn it today with example so let us write down a script tag then javascript this is the beginning of a script and this is the end okay now what we like to do let us take a variable give its name m and keep something within this let's take another variable that is your n and keep something within this inside m we keep 20 and inside n we keep 50 now <clears throat> what you like to do look here I am taking a variable and I am just trying to add this n plus m but look I keep it within what quotation what does it mean it means here n plus m it is without within double quotation means it's a string so if it is a string then if I write it down alert method and inside this alert method I will sum to display whatever inside sum but look sum is containing n plus m but that is within double quotation means n plus m is a string in that case obviously summation will not happen here so <clears throat> what we will get in this case let us go to output and check uh, what we are getting right so i will save it okay look i am just getting in plus n that means whatever i wrote inside double quotation i am getting it as result but i like i like to perform this sub summation even it within double quotation in that case what we will do let us use this eval method now right okay, so what this eval method will do eval method will convert this string into integer and will perform the summation in between n plus n so in this way it is evaluating its arguments means uh, it is performing the task what you like to, to do means you like to do the summation so the eval method will convert this is convert this string into integer and uh, <clears throat> it will perform the summation okay so let us uh, see the output what we are getting here now look, we are getting 70 that means even this is within is within double quotation means string this evolve method is omitting or ignoring this double quotation and is performing the summation in between n plus m in this way eval method is executing is executing or evaluating its argument okay in, <clears throat> so this is basically the function of your eval method now another example you can check it again suppose you like to add like this um, x and uh, what you are trying to do now you like to add m plus um, suppose 40 m plus 40 okay and this is suppose within uh, the same way if, if it is within your quotation double quotation so obviously if i like to see what is inside x uh, what we will get this is a string so as output we will get m plus 40 
Yeah, if you use eval, in that case, this a, this m plus 40 within double quotation will be its argument, means argument of eval method. And this eval method will execute or evaluate its argument and will perform the summation in between m and 40 means m means, m means 20 plus 40 that means we will get as result 60 so let us go to output now and see what the result you are getting look we are getting 60 in this way actually the eval method performs its evaluation or execution of its argument so there is a eval method so goodbye today everybody I will meet you again in my next tutorial with few more topics regarding JavaScript. So for today, goodbye everybody. Goodbye.